So, first of all, I want to thank you for the invitation to all the members of, of the group and thank you to all the attendants. For me, it's a privilege to, uh, to be able to present my material to my colleagues from so many parts of the world. And in advance, I put myself at your service for any questions or comments you may have. So please write down everything you want to comment in the space for chats. And at the end of talk, we, we will dedicate the time required to, to, to talk and try to solve any question, OK? Um, in any case, please write down this information in the event that any of your comments arrive after, after the exhibition is over. I promise to answer you shortly. It is very important that you know that all comments are, are welcome. So I'm going to start. And now, yes, let's go into the matter. About 10 years ago, JCO magazine published an article of the first lingual orthodontic wire bending robot I invent in its April issue. Uh, I must confess to you that uh, seen in retrospective, the robot had quite a few limitations, but it is fair to mention that some journals follow up the development of the robot. And we opened the interest worldwide about robotics in the lingual technique. So the same magazine published two more articles analyzing the operation of my, of my system. Uh, some universities, both in Mexico and abroad, contact me to learn firsthand about how the robot works. Let me show you a, a short video they, they download around 10 years ago. Comúnmente, los alambres utilizados en ortodoncia se doblan manualmente. Investigadores de la UNAM crearon un robot doblador de alambres de ortodoncia.